Here's a short video talking about bend tables in sheet metal. So I've got a part on the screen now. It's got a, a number of different bends in there and uh, I can create a flat pattern and generate the flat pattern view. Once this has been created, we can go and have a look at that view and I've got all of my bend information detailed out into individual leader labels here and each one of these has a bend sequence number. Now I can clean this up and just have the number or put as much information for each bend as I see fit. So if we have a look up here and we have the bend list. So I can review the bend list within the part and I can change the order to get different bend names to facilitate the order of creation. If I switch to PMI and insert an instance, I can create a bend table for my flat pattern view. Select the view, say OK, and my bend table has been created. And I've got all of my bends, in this case 1 to 16, with their name, the radius, neutral factor, angle, and so on, and direction. Let's just uh, back up a little bit and say I don't want to use the, uh, the, the PMI method, I just want to go to drafting for example. So I switch to drafting, define my sheet size, and I'm just going to scale this down because it's a fairly small, and drop my flat pattern view on the drawing, and up in the table group, you may need to enable it if it's not already there, I can go bend table and create a bend table for my flat pattern view and I get the same information. So a couple of different ways, both uh, within PMI in the flat pattern view in modeling, uh, using the bend table command in drafting. And if I switch back to modeling and come into, let's say the top view, I can also generate in PMI I can insert into the 3D view here a bend table from the actual part rather than flat pattern view within the part itself. And here I'm selecting the body that they apply to. I can hit OK and generate the, the table information. Just spin it round because I've generated it in the different view. And you can see my labels here for each bend have been generated and the table has been created. So a few ways there to create bend table information in NX Sheet Metal.